There are several Indians who have contributed towards conservation in India. In this video, we will be seeing some of the key contributions of few Indian conservationists. Bird Man of India Dr. Salim was the first Indian to conduct systematic bird surveys across India and wrote several bird books that popularized ornithology in India. His full name is Dr. Salim Moizuddin Abdul Ali and was born on 12th November 1896 in Mumbai. In 1947, he was the key figure behind the Bombay Natural History Society, which was founded in 1883. In 1958, he was awarded the most prestigious Padma Bhushan Award. In 1974, along with Sidney Dillon Ripley, he wrote the landmark 10-volume Handbook of the Birds of India and Pakistan. In 1975, he was awarded the J. Paul Getty Award for Conservation Leadership. In 1976, he was awarded the most prestigious Padma Vibhushan Award by the Government of India. In 2007, in his honour, the Ministry of Environment and Forests established the Dr. Salim Ali National Wildlife Fellowship Award. On his 100th birth anniversary, Indian Postal Department released a set of two postal stamps in acknowledgement of Dr. Salim's contributions. Several species of birds, a couple of bird sanctuaries and institutions have been named after him. Butterfly Man of India Mr. K. M. Kerr was born and brought up in a Marathi-speaking Jew family. He is an Indian naturalist, photographer, author and a teacher. His full name is Mr. Isaac David Kevinkar and was born on 21st May 1957 in Maharashtra. In 2014, he was awarded the Green Teacher Award. In 2015, he was awarded the Sanctuary Asia Kirloskar Vasundra Award. In 2016, he released his book titled Butterflies of India. In 2017, he joined iNature Watch Foundation. He has authored many books, which includes the bestseller, The Book of Indian Butterflies, published by Bombay Natural History Society. Crow Man of India Mr. Naveen has been intimately interacting with crows and have been studying their behavior for more than 50 years. His full name is Mr. Naveen Khanna and was born on 8th February 1945 in Firozpur of Punjab. In 1995, 2002 and 2009, his contributions have been acknowledged by the Limca Book of Records for Nature. There is also a dedicated film by Channel 9 of Australia on his interaction with the crows. He has also authored a book titled Kavon Ke Saad Dosti Ke Paintalis Varsh, which means 45 years of friendship with crows. He has 29 crow friends and each one has been given a special name that reflects their unique characters and has authored many books. Dolphin Man of India Dr. Ravindra is known for the conservation of gangetic dolphins. His full name is Dr. Ravindra Kumar Sinha. He was born on 1st July 1954 in Jahanabad of Bihar. In 1999, his contributions were acknowledged by His Royal Highness Prince Bernard of the Netherlands. In the year 2000, he was awarded the Golden Jubilee Award for National Academy of Sciences by the Government of India. In 2016, he was awarded the prestigious Padma Shri by the President of India. Gangetic dolphins are an endangered species of freshwater dolphins found in the Indus and Ganges rivers. They have also been recognized as the national aquatic animal of India. Dr. R. K. Sinha surveyed the entire length of the Ganges and assessed the distribution, population, ecological requirements and threats to dolphin population. Dolphins were facing extinction due to indiscriminate poaching and habitat degradation and loss in many areas. Dr. Sinha organized education and awareness drives among fishermen as well as students. His research was widely distributed, attracting the attention of policymakers to take measures in protecting these endangered gangetic dolphins.
Elephant Man of Asia. Dr. Sharma completed his veterinary graduation in 1984 and was a gold medalist. His full name is Dr. Kushal Konwar Sharma, born on 1st March 1961 in Assam. In 1987, he joined as an assistant professor in Assam Agricultural University and became the head of the surgery department in 2012. In 2012, he was bestowed an award of excellence by the Chief Minister of Assam for rescue of rhinos and wild animals. In 2014, a certificate of recognition for conservation of Asian elephant was awarded by the university in USA. In 2018, he was bestowed with an award of excellence by the governor and he also honored him with the title Elephant Man of Asia. In 2020, he was awarded the most prestigious Padma Shri award in honor of his contribution in the field of veterinary medicine. Dr. Sharma has authored over 150 research papers, authored 6 books, guided 45 students in PhD and masters in veterinary science and published over 100 articles. He attends over 700 elephants annually for preemptive and on-call basis all over India and Asia. Dr. Sharma is a member of the steering committee and captive elephant healthcare and welfare committee of Project Elephant. Forest man of India Mr Paing was born in the indigenous missing tribe of Assam his full name is Mr Jadav Molai Paing born on 1963 in Jora district of Assam in 2012 he was honored by the school of environment sciences Jawaharlal Nehru university Dr Sudhir the Jawaharlal Nehru university's vice chancellor named him the forest man of india in 2013 he was honored by the indian institute of forest management In 2015 he was awarded the most prestigious Padma Shri award the highest ever civilian award by the government of India Over the course of several decades Mr Paying has planted and tended trees on a sandbar of the Brahmaputra river turning it into a forest reserve the Molai forest named after him is located in Jorhat district of Assam It encompasses an area of about 1360 acres. Even the forest officials were surprised to see such a large and dense forest which has become a home for more than 150 elephants, 100 deer, rabbits, including Bengal tigers, rhinos and other diverse species of birds and wild animals. Frog man of India Dr Biju is known for amphibian research and conservation his full name is Dr Satyabhama Das Biju born on May 1963 in Kerala in 2006 he established the systemics lab at the university of delhi to train researchers in the field of herpetology in 2008 he received the iucn sabin award for amphibian conservation in 2010 In collaboration with national and international institutions he launched the nationwide lost amphibians of india campaign in 2011 he was awarded the sanctuary wildlife service award dr biju has extensively published several journals and written books on both plants and amphibians the lost amphibians of india campaign initiated by dr biju has 600 team members and has conducted about 42 field expeditions Snake man of India Mr Romulus is known for wildlife film making herpetology and rolex awards His full name is Mr Romulus Earl Whitaker born on 23rd May 1943 in New York USA In 1972 he founded India's first reptile park the Chennai Snake Park In 1976 he established the Madras Crocodile Bank Trust to protect the three species of Indian crocodiles In 2005 he won the Whitley award for his work and used the award to establish Agumbe Rainforest Research Station in Karnataka to study and conserve king cobras and rainforests. In 2008 he became the associate laureate in Rolex awards. In 2018 he was awarded the Padma Shri by the government of India for his work done in the field of wildlife conservation. Few snake species such as Indian boa and Romulus crate are named in honor of Mr Romulus Whitaker. He is an honorary consultant of IUCN Species Survival Commission, vice chairman of IUCN Crocodile Specialist Group, 
member of IUCN reptile and amphibian group and also the member of IUCN sea turtle specialist group. Sparrow Man of India Mr. Dilawar has a master's in ecology. He has worked as a lecturer and head of the department at the RYK College of Science in Nashik, Maharashtra and later joined the Royal Society for the Protection of Birds in 2006. His full name is Mr. Mohammed Dilawar. He was born on 20th March 1980 in Maharashtra. In 2008, he was named Heroes of the Environment by Time magazine in their list of 30 most influential environmentalists in the world. In 2009, he founded the Nature Forever Society. In 2011, he was the recipient of Limca Book of Records for conservation of house sparrows and Guinness Book of Records for the largest distribution of bird feeders in the world. In 2013, Times Now News Network named him one of the amazing Indians in regard to his work on conservation of house sparrows in the country. Mr. Dilawar is a member of the International Working Group on Urban Sparrows and represents the Afro-Asian region. He has also initiated the project Save Our Sparrows and the annual Sparrows Awards. Mr. Jagat Kinkabwala is also known as a Sparrow Man. He is an environmental conservationist. He has been campaigning for over a decade and is fondly known as the savior of the sparrows. He has also published a book Save the Sparrows and has been praised by Honorable Prime Minister for his contribution towards the environment. Mr. Rakesh Khatri is known as the Nest Man of India. He has made 1.25 lakh bird nests and has been recognized by the London World Book of Records. Tiger Man of India Mr. Sankala was known for his environmental activism and for his role as the first director of Project Tiger. His full name is Mr. Kailash Sankhala, born on 30th Jan 1925 in Jodhpur of Rajasthan. In 1965, he was bestowed with a merit award for outstanding contribution in wildlife conservation by the Rajasthan government. In 1970, he was the first civil servant to receive the Jawaharlal Nehru Fellowship to study the tiger. In 1982, he was given a merit award for his book on the tiger. In 1992, he was awarded the most prestigious Padma Shri by the President of India. In 2008, in his honor, the Ministry of Environment and Forest established the Kailash Sankhala National Wildlife Fellowship Award. After his death, his son Pradeep Sankhala took over the charge of the Tiger Trust. Waterman of India Dr. Rajendra is known for water-based conservation. His full name is Dr. Rajendra Singh, born on 6th August 1959 in Uttar Pradesh. In 1975, he founded an NGO called Tarun Bharat Sangh for water conservation. In 2001, he received the Ramon Max Essay Award for his pioneering work in community-based efforts in water harvesting and water management. In 2005, he received the Jamnalal Bajaj Award for application of science and technology for rural development. In 2008, the Guardian named him amongst its list of 50 people who could save the planet. In 2015, he won the Stockholm Water Prize, an award known as the Nobel Prize for Water. In 2016, he was bestowed with Ahimsa Award by Institute of Genealogy based in UK. He has been instrumental in helping villages take charge of water management in their semi-arid regions, especially close to tar deserts, through use of rainwater storage tanks, check dams and other path-breaking techniques. 